Lucky Poo. Bye bye. So thrush is a infection that horses get into their hooves, um, usually by standing in wet mud or manure, um, anything that would have this bacteria. It's been raining a lot here uh, this past year. And I mean, I'm in this field now and it's pretty dry. It's actually very dry. Um, but I've noticed that the horses like to sleep where it's super muddy. And so I'm sure they'll, they probably stand in the mud pit all night. I'm sure that's what is behind this thrush culprit. So this is what the pure soul looks like. It's just basically like a mud that you pack into your horse's hooves. Um, it smells like my mother's spice cabinet. <laughs> it's a very strong smell. Um, so that's what we're working with here. So the lid says it has apple cider vinegar, organic coconut oil, bentonite clay, eucalyptus, lavender, uh, white willow bark, organic oregano leaf. So it seems to be a very natural substance to use on your horse, not really a lot of chemicals. Um, I feel like that's probably why people like this stuff. So here's Tucker's hoof now. Um, it does look pretty long just because we're about due for the farrier. But you can see on the bulb of his foot he has this split and that is thrush happening. And it has that kind of horrible smell that thrush has too. So I'm going to put some of this pure soul stuff in there. So here's the hoof packed with the pure soul. I just packed it into that crevice in the frog, as you can see. Filled in that spot um, into around the frog. And the frog is kind of shedding, so I made sure to stick it up into where it was starting to break off. Just because I know that's where thrush tends to grow. And so I'm going to leave that in his hoof all day and overnight, and I'll come back tomorrow and do it again. So it's day five using Pure Soul. Um, good news is it's been dry all week, so hopefully that's helping their feet dry out. So we'll see. Farrier comes in seven days. His feet don't look much different, but uh, I guess we'll get the final word from her. So this is what his feet look like today. Um, not much difference, I don't think. The only thing is the smell of the thrush isn't that prominent compared to usual, which I guess that is good. Um, but at the same time, you can't really tell because you can also really smell the pure soul. So I'll fill his hoof again, check it out tomorrow. So here's what his foot looks like after about 11 days he used pure soul. Looks a lot drier, which is good. So today Tucker's feet look great. Um, I'm not sure if it's because of the dry weather or because of the pure soul. I'm sure it's both. But it looks like the thrush has just cleared right up and in like a day. Like yesterday I was worried about his feet and today I'm like, man, they look great. So it's actually supposed to rain in the next few days and make the ground soggy again and the horses hoof soggy again. So we'll see what happens. Um, I plan on packing his hooves full of some pure soul before then, and we'll see what the rain can do. So it's farrier day, and Tucker's feet are looking great. So we'll see what she says about how that pure soul worked for his thrush. It's probably about a week after the farrier visited um, and checked out Tucker's hooves, and I've continued to use the pure soul, and I'm just amazed at the difference that I've seen in his hooves just over the week. So I wanted to show you real quick just what I'm seeing and how well the pure soul is working. So here's the latest look at Tucker's foot. As you can tell, um, it's getting dry. It's actually starting to flake, so he probably needs some nutrients. Um, but look at this crack. It's gotten much smaller. You can see where it was, which is like where my thumb is almost. And then it's starting to shrink. Like I said, it's only been a week. So take a look at that. And the vet said that um, you'll know that he's out of the dark when this crack is just gone. So knowing that it's getting smaller really lets me know that this pure soul is working and that it's helping to get rid of the thrush. So like I said earlier, this is a great product. I definitely recommend you use it. 
I'm not sponsored by them. They didn't pay me to make this video. I solely just did this because everyone was talking about this product and I wanted to see if what they were saying was true. So go check out this Pure Soul um, and I hope it helps you and your horse. Remember to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Go check out our website, equinehelper.com.